What's good? What's good, everyone? It's Young Reno, the Rookie Chef. And yes, we are back with another episode of Highlighting Our Co-Chefs, episode 56, y'all. I done highlighted 56 chefs, and I'm so happy. I try to help their numbers. I try to help them grow. And the ones that are already up there, I still like to show my respect because they highlighted me. All right. So with that said, I know we haven't had a, a, a episode of Highlight Our Co-Chefs in, in the last couple weeks, but I'm back to do it now. Okay. Introducing episode 56 of Highlight Our Co-Chefs, and I got them all ready for you. Okay. So with that said, let's get ready to get this party started. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ow. Right, y'all. So for our first chef up, up is going to be Chef Olivia, and she has a channel called Olivia's Fun House. Okay, she's going to be doing some uh, some yummy goodness that y'all going to like. She's going to be doing some um, high protein egg muffins, and I love the way she did it. Came out super good, super yummy, yummy goodness at the end. But y'all already know you only get to see a sneak preview of her, and it's up to you to go back to her channel. To finish it all, finish the rest, okay? So with that, with that said, Chef Olivia, why don't you go ahead and tell about those high protein egg muffins? Let's go. So I'm just cracking eggs into my pre-greased muffin tin. Excited already, this looks great. Yeah, okay, last one. Perfect. Next, I've got some cottage cheese. Ooh. And I'm just gonna take a little scoop and place it into each one of my wow. muffin pockets. What a great idea. Mm -hmm. Very high protein. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and give this a little bit of a whisk. Get our egg and our cottage cheese. All nice and mix in there. Spoon. Get it all nice and stirred. Perfect. All right, y'all, this is Chef Olivia's uh, Fun House channel right here. This is her channel right there, y'all, okay? Uh, she has 527 subscribers. Let's go ahead and help her get up there, y'all. Let's help her see her grow, all right? And I'm hoping that my highlight will do just that, all right? This is Chef Olivia, Olivia's Fun House, all right? She got 176 videos. She definitely, definitely, definitely should have more subs up there, okay? Keep doing what you do, chef. And y'all go back to finish those, that good old yummy goodness she was doing. Y'all gonna be surprised at the end. It came out good at the end. And when she used that muffin pan, man, y'all gonna see what them eggs did. Y'all, I'm not even gonna tell you. You got to go watch it yourself, okay? The most important thing I want y'all to do is let Chef Olivia know that the rookie chef sent you, okay? Because like I always say, they might not know. Um, so... Make sure you let them know that the Rookie Chef highlighted them on his channel so that they can go over there and check it out for themselves, okay? Because like I said, a lot of them do not know on their own. They find out later, all right? So let them know. With that said, Chef Olivia, keep up the good work. I love your channel. Got a lot of good stuff going there. Let's keep it moving. Oh, yeah, and Chef, Chef Olivia, um, just a thought. Try taking your camera, your phone or whatever, Turn it sideways so you can get that big, beautiful cinema look. Your videos are so beautiful. Try filming with your phone sideways so that way everybody can get that big, beautiful widescreen look. I would love to see your videos in widescreen. Okay, just a thought. Let's go. All right, y'all. Next up, we got um, Cook's Flip. All right, that's his channel called Cook's Flip. We're going to call him Chef Cook. Now... He is making, on the side, some smashed potatoes. Y'all gonna like how, he, like, like how he does it. Very clever. You know, he's using like a little shot glass or something he's using to smash them up. And he's using his little griddle. I mean, it's, it's excellent, okay? He's gonna be our second chef we're highlighting, okay? So uh, y'all know what y'all gonna do. Check him out. Uh, let him know how you doing those smashed potatoes, Chef Cook. Let's go. 
I'm just gonna smash these potatoes with uh, really anything you got. I like these pint glasses, they're pretty good. You can use a coffee mug, whatever you got. And I sprayed a little bit of oil on the bottom of this glass so that less potato sticks. But it's not that big a deal if you don't do that. I got butter on the pan. We're gonna cook these on the grill. I'm gonna re spray it. It's all about the roll, I think. Oh. Yeah, that's it. Don't look like much now, we just wait. Alright, so I'm gonna do a little olive oil drizzle on there. Alright y'all, here is his channel. Yes, I had to stop it right there because I want y'all to be in suspense. Y'all got to go back and finish that video. See what he did to them smashed potatoes. Y'all going to be impressed at the end. Very clever, Chef Cook. You did that. Love it. Alright though, so this chef here has 16 subscribers and 35 videos, alright? Cook's Flip, that's the name of his page. Y'all make sure y'all go check out that video. Go like, share, and subscribe. Make sure you let him know the Rookie Chef sent you. Make sure you let him know that the Rookie Chef has a show called Highlighting Our Co-Chefs in our YouTube Chef family, and he has been highlighted there. That's where he can find me. All right, go like, share, and subscribe. And the most important thing, like I said, let him know the Rookie Chef sent you. All right, we hope to help you get those subscribers up. 16 subscribers, we know we can do a lot, lot better, and we will because you got some nice foods on your channel. All right, keep up the good work, Chef. The Rookie Chef is always here. Let's go. All right, y'all. <clears throat> our third and final chef in our highlighting our co-chefs and our YouTube chef family is gonna be Chef Michael Bosch, okay? Michael Bosch is gonna be showing y'all how to activate dry yeast to prepare y'all to make bread, okay? His channel is really cool. We got a lot of cool little fun stuff he does. Uh, with his cooking and preparation, I think you're going to really love it, okay? But for now, let him let you know how it is to activate yeast the Michael Boss way. Chef Michael, why don't you go ahead, go ahead and let them know what you're talking about with this activating dry yeast. Let's go. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my kitchen. My name is Michael, and today I'm going to be making some bread, and I thought I would show you how I activate my dry yeast. Even though the back of the package says you don't have to do this, you can add it right to the dry ingredients. I always do this when I'm making my bread because what I don't want to happen is to make the bread and find out two or three hours later that the rise is not going to happen because the yeast is dead. So what we're going to do is we're going to take some water and I've got a cup and a half of water here that I'm going to use as my demonstration today. And you want your temperature of your water to be between 100 and 110 degrees Fahrenheit. So whatever you've got to measure that with, just take that and take a measurement I just always just use a thermometer and that way I know that I've got an accurate read uh, between 100 and 110 degrees Fahrenheit. So what we're going to do now is if you've got the little packets that you get in the store to use, you can definitely uh, use those. I make a lot of bread so I buy the yeast in bulk. So one of those little packages is two and a quarter teaspoons of this. So if you've got the bulk and you make a lot of bread then put two and a quarter teaspoons of your yeast into your water or you can use one of the little packages just like that now you can do it just like that and give it a stir if you want to yeast love sugar so if you want to put a little bit of sugar this is about a teaspoon of sugar you can put that in with your yeast give that a little stir with the spoon and set that aside for about five to ten minutes and you can let this bloom and we'll see what that looks like in just a minute and there he is everyone Michael Boss cooking, the man himself. Chef Michael, 
I know now when I'm ready to make some bread, I'm definitely going to take your advice on that, okay? Because I've never did bread yet on my channel. But there's a lot of things I haven't done that I'm going to do, okay? So thank you for that. All right, y'all. Y'all go back and finish how he activated that geese for that bread at the end. And you're going to learn some good things. And make sure you check out his channel because he got a lot of good fun stuff on his channel too, okay? Make sure you go like, share, and subscribe. He has 553 subscribers and 145 videos. Let's help Chef Michael get those numbers up, okay? Chef Michael, keep up the good work. Make sure y'all go uh, let him know that the Rookie Chef sent you. Let him know that there's a chef out there highlighting chefs by the name of Young Reno, the Rookie Chef, okay? Let him know to go to my channel. He will find it right there on episode 56. Okay? Keep up the good work, Mike. We love you. Keep doing what you do, man. Keep doing what you do, Chef. This is how we roll, okay? All right, y'all. Go finish it out. Let him know the rookie chef sent you. Let's keep it moving. All right, y'all. That sums it up for highlighting our co-chefs and our YouTube chef family. Episode 56. Make sure you go visit all three of those chefs. Make sure you let them know the rookie chef sent you. And y'all go watch all those videos that I just showed you to the end. I'm pretty sure you're going to find it very good. And all their other cookings is very good. You're going to like their channel. Okay, let's help them grow. All right. And just a quick reminder, y'all, these videos are for educational purposes only. This is not to infringe on any of these chefs contents rights okay this is only to help promote and share their content so that way they can boost up like everybody else and be happy be joyful and keep on cooking okay uh cooking purposes educational purposes only that's it all right y'all with that said i am the rookie chef young reno nice to see y'all again and uh next time we'll be coming with uh well let me let me share something with y'all real quick there will not be no Tuesday to me this time because of Memorial Day. I am gonna be uh, I'm gonna be uh, staying with some folks uh, for Memorial Day overnight up until Tuesday night, and I'll be back on Wednesday. So because of the holiday, y'all, there will be no Tuesday to me, but we will continue it the week after. Okay. Hope everybody have a beautiful Memorial Day, y'all. Happy Memorial Day to y'all. I know a lot of y'all going to be uh, barbecuing. A lot of y'all going to be using the grill. And I'm sure some of our co-chefs and our YouTube chef family here is definitely going to be uh, putting a video out there of their Memorial Day. Okay. So that's what I'm talking about. Uh, TRC family, y'all. The Rookie Chef. TRC family in the house, y'all. Y'all all are part of the TRC family. I love y'all and God bless. Have a safe memorial. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.